Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. Today's video, I'll be showing you how to play a DVD on your Windows 10 computer, desktop, laptop, or Surface. Before I begin, give this video a like, comment down below if this, this way helped you at all, if you know a different way on how to play a DVD on your computer, let me know, comment down below. And definitely subscribe if you're new to the channel, it supports the channel and I appreciate everything. So playing a DVD on your computer, uh, desktop, laptop, or Surface, Windows 10. It's not as easy as, as one may think it is. I mean, it's not super difficult, um, but it, it's no longer easy of, of just pop, plopping a DVD in and let it spin up and, and playing automatically. So I'm gonna show you a way how to do this. Um, be a couple steps involved, but once you get all set up, it'll be a piece of cake, sorry, excuse me. Be a piece of cake, so the next time you put a DVD in, all you have to do is click two things and you're off and running. So let me begin. Uh, first thing you wanna do is you want to download what's called the VLC player. Now to do this, you wanna hop into a web browser, Google Chrome, Internet Explorer, Firefox, any web browser will do. I'm gonna jump into Chrome. Just go to Google, um, whatever web browser you're comfortable with and just Google search for VLC player. VLC player download. From here, you're gonna click on the first link and you're gonna click on download VLC and I'll say VLC for Windows. Take a little bit here. Now it should say thanks, your download will start in a few seconds. If not, click here. Mine's starting to go right now at the bottom left hand corner. If you're on Chrome like I am, if you're on Internet Explorer, it may show it at the top, it may show it at the bottom, same thing with Firefox. So once it's done, you'll see that the flashing circle was flashing. Um, it's done flashing, that means it's, it's done installing, so just click it, click to open it, and right here you're going to get a message that says, do you want to allow this app to change it, make changes to your device? Just hit yes. It's basically asking you it wants permission to install to your, your computer, so hit yes. Please select the language, just go with English or choose whatever language you're most comfortable with. I'm gonna go with English and we hit OK. Welcome to VLC Media Player Setup. Just hit Next. If you want to read through this, you can, but it's just telling you how to set this all up. Again, same thing, hit Next on the license agreement. And hit Next one more time. And then hit Install. So it's gonna install. Um, so what VLC does is, is it acts as a media player to play your, your DVDs, your movies. Because um, Windows Media Player doesn't really work too well with Windows 10. It's not the default media player as it was in the past, where you could just drop a movie in and it would start playing automatically. Um, but like I said, once this is done, I'll get you up and running and you'll be ready to go. So this will download here. Okay, so it's gonna say completing your VLC media player setup. Run VLC media player now. I'm just gonna untick that. If you leave that ticked and you hit finish, it'll pop up automatically. We don't wanna do that for now and I'll show you why in a second. But just hit finish. Close out of Chrome for me. Okay, so now hopefully if you're on a desktop or a laptop, you have a movie in already ready to go. If not, go ahead and put that movie in. Right now I'm on a Surface, so I have an external DVD player that plugs into my USB port, which is totally fine. Acts as the same thing as if you stuck a movie into a disk drive, laptop or a desktop. So put your movie in. Yeah, I got VLC media player downloaded. Should have the app on your desktop as you do right here, as I do. So once that's all done, you got the movie in, you got, you know, you got your application installed. I want you to click on the search bar right here, type here to search. And type in Windows Explorer. File Explorer will come up, click on that. File Explorer window will pop up. Now if you scroll down, you're gonna see that it says DVD RW drive. So basically, that is your disk drive, whatever drive that you're working with. If it's built-in drive in your computer, or if it's an external DVD drive. Whatever you have, it'll say DVD drive on it. I have a disc in here right now, and you possibly will as well. So 
I want you to do me a favor. I want you to click on that DVD drive, hold your mouse in, and drag it to your desktop. Kind of like that. Now, it made a CD drive shortcut on your desktop. So anytime you put a movie in, if it's this movie, if it's a different movie, put it in there. And once it loads, you know, you'll hear it spinning, but it won't take that long. Right click on your icon, like the shortcut you made, and just click on play with VLC media player. First thing on the list. So right click it, click on play with VLC media player. Now your disc will start to boot up here. VLC player will come up and you're ready to rock. So the DVD that I have put in right now is the, let me turn it down, is the um, Philadelphia Eagles Super Bowl 52 champions. I'm an Eagles fan in case you didn't know. Um, so I went with this movie. I'm just going to click play program. I'm not going to play a lot of it because I don't want to get a copyright strike from the NFL or the Eagles. If I hit play program, you may hit play movie, right? So it's going to go through everything. The movie controls are down here, pause, stop, rewind, fast forward. I'm just going to jump. This is this movie just goes through the, the Eagles, their Super Bowl season of each game that they won. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to show you a little bit of the end of the Super Bowl 52 where the Eagles won their first Super Bowl championship. Just like yesterday. I'm going to cry. Anyway, so yeah. I'm going to get all emotional. One of the best days of my life when they won. But I've been an Eagles fan all my life. And to see this, I'll see this multiple times. It's just never gets old. I'll never get old. They won. I watch it over and over. But that's just me. Um, but yeah, so that's how you play a movie with the LC player. Is if you just follow those simple steps... It would be golden. You just got to download a VLC player, make a CD drive shortcut. Like I said, once you put a movie in, all you do is right-click this guy and play with VLC, and you're good to go. So hopefully this video helped, guys. Give it a like, thumb it up, comment down below if you know a different way. I know there's many ways, um, but to me personally, I think this is the easiest way. That's just me. Comment down below if you have a different way, and subscribe if you're new to the channel, and I'll see you guys on the next one.